All right, guys. So we're on our way to Walmart, Pro City, uh, to meet up with another collector here in Hawaii, Nate Gomez, uh, to pick up a uh, figure that he ordered an extra and I'm literally buying from him and well we're there we might as well do a little toy hunt so stick around and see what happens this is pretty cool they have the turtles Leo and Don four of them and in the back Casey Jones and Raphael from the movie Turtles Aliens, Brittany, Ozzy Mecca Freddy or Freddy Jason <laughs> E.T. Nothing that really touches more pops. <coughs> Black Panther. Love and Thunder. Still a lot of big old Black Panther, Black Panther figures. Some Spider-Man, some Love and Thunder. A lot of RC stuff. Seen this at the Lego store. And yes, you can manually transform him. I think that's the coolest thing. Jurassic Park or Jurassic World. Some Marvel, some DC, Harry Potter, like I said, Hawaii usually gets the end of the shipments, the stuff that nobody wants. We don't get the good stuff for a couple months after everybody else does. Which kind of sucks. Uh, sorry, Adam. It's a lot of you. One Jake. One Frankie. One Trent. <laughs> Two Trents. And a Chuck. Minecraft. Fortnite. I think these are pretty cool, but not worth it. You guys know me, you know I want something <clears throat> either die cast or more stable. <clears throat> this 
far as the minifigs go, <laughs> literally Lando. Series black, one Lando left, one Dinjitarin. And you can see the difference between the mainland stores and Hawaii stores. Kind of forever. Now yeah, we got Crockmaster in. Although I already have him. It's all Lady J. It's funny and uh, my working place, we have two of the original classified Lady J's that we can't sell. Well guys, that's it. All right guys, uh, just a quickie, just came back from meeting fellow collector Nate Gomez. Check it out. Gave me a cool Macho Man shirt. Well, for those of you who don't know, I'm also a ref for Hawaii's own Oos Wrestling, senior official at, or was a senior official at Hawaii's other wrestling, AZW. So I am a huge wrestling fan. I've got to meet a few great people in our business. So thank you, Nate, for the shirt and for this. He ordered two of them and was nice enough to sell me one of them. So I'm seriously stoked. This is one of the two surprises I have in store for you guys this week. The other one should be here. Possibly anytime. Tomorrow, Wednesday, or Thursday, or Friday. I'll give it some time. G.I. Joe Classifieds, Dr. Mindbender. Just turn that off. This is the side of the box, number 43 G.I. Joe. Can barely see these, but it has the Dr. Mindbender name on top, Cobra symbol with number 43. And it slides out. Now, for those of you who do not recognize this, of course, it's the Cobra symbols up and down. However, it's made to look very similar to the DNA pattern or of a DNA pattern, which if you remember the cartoon, Mindbender was the one that took DNA from some of the greatest conquerors, leaders in, of the, our time, and created Serpentor. Still the same. Now, 
this isn't about Serpentor, so we'll get into him a little later. There's a few things that is on my mind about him that we'll talk about. But check this out. Mindbender Reading Tunes. The uh, DNA, Spiral of Life from the Cobra cartoon. A huge picture of him. Underwater tune. And Mindbender with all the great leaders dead. See, uh, this is Napoleon. The next one next to him looks like an Egyptian dude. I forget who that was. There's also a small picture of Mindbender, Baroness Industrial, with Serpenter's helmet. I definitely need to go back and watch the uh, cartoon for it. There's a few beats. I remember Genghis Khan because he was one of my favorites. Napoleon Rasputin Dracula Vlad, or Vlad the Impaler there was a lot of great DNA in there. Sergeant Slaughter. But the front opens up. And ta-da! This is still them using plastic. Uh, so on this one, you we have his gun. And the small and large containers. On this side, we have an in injector and what looks like a, I don't know, a water or a smoke shooting device, a smaller version of it, the canister that should have the liquid. There's a partial skull, a brain, and a hand that actually fits into these two. But honestly, I, I'm ecstatic. I mean, look at him. He looks like the freaking cartoon. Uh, Although there's plastic all over the place, for the background, none of these actually have plastic to cover them, including the figure. You can actually touch him. Yeah, that sounds bad. I don't know why they did it, but I, this is a whole lot better packaging than the non-plastics that they're doing right now. And if you see the way this is made, it's made so... This doesn't slip out. Holy crap, this figure is awesome. With him, and what's coming, I almost have the entire, I guess, Cobra Elite, the command module of Cobra. Uh, I definitely want some kind of version of Scrap Iron. There is a few Cobra figures, well, main figures like possibly Big Boa if they come out with one. I definitely want Crystal Ball. I'm not sure why. Uh, don't want Raptor. But literally it's almost 
complete as far as the command of Cobra goes. Uh, I do want Wild Weasel. I do want Copperhead. I think everything else would will be Cobra Troopers. Uh, there are a ton of G.I. Joes I definitely want. And if you know me, you know... <clears throat> I will be getting the Retro Firefly when that comes out. But I am a huge Zartan and the Dreadnoughts fan. And I will definitely try and collect all of the Dreadnoughts. And... You know, I, I know a lot of you are like, well, that's not too many. Uh, yeah, no. They, I think, what most normal people know of the Dreadnoughts, you know, maybe six, seven, maybe, of them. I, I am fairly certain that's only half of the Dreadnoughts. Besides Zartan, Zorana, and Zanzibar, or Zor Zandar, there is the Zanzibar, the pirate, Thrasher, with the Thunder Machine, Buzzer Ripper Torch, the original three, Monkey Wrench, uh, there is a one called Storm Rider, Granada Hide, Road Pig, there is a few other ones that came out that I'm hoping comes out for classified and I can't wait. But like I said, there's a little surprise coming in a couple of days. I'm trying to you know, finish up the room. As you can see, we're still I haven't gotten anything done. Uh, the one thing myself and Nate did talk about, though, is the Retro Cobra Commander. And l let me f assure you guys that the Retro Cobra Commander, the figure itself, will be coming to Walmarts as a Walmart exclusive carded figure. Uh, I'm pretty sure they're going to announce that next year probably next year probably at the next G.I. Joe Hasbro post thing I've heard rumors of a another G.I. Joe Haslab project that's coming out one for the G.I. Joe teams uh, one rumor is that it's the Wolverine and I'm literally saying no it's not because they wouldn't bring out CoverGirl separately from the Wolverine. If it's a G.I. Joe has lab I honestly would love to see the G.I. Joe Vamp the original or what actually came out that we know of in the if you look back right after they created the Hazlab Cobra His Tank they released a Transformer version of it Megatron and if you look on the G.I. Joe side they release the All Striker, and if for what I'm thinking, if it's not the Vamp, it might be the GI Joe All Striker. Honestly, I'm not a fan of it. I'd rather have the Vamp, and the only other Hazlab that I might get from Cobra is a Stunner. Imagine that freaking being huge uh well i mean there is a thunder machine that if they do a has lab 
I might have to get now for those of you who have not looked it up or heard there are four figures coming with the Cobra Hiss tank the Cobra Hiss driver which is basically a classified version of the driver uh, a female driver which looks a little bit different but not by much except for the you know female body and the Cobra Hiss tactician which again looks like the driver but a little bit different in colors but it also comes with a retro Cobra commander now you guys I told you guys about the Retro Commander coming out for Walmart. So the one that's coming out for the Hiss tanks will be pretty similar. The only difference from what we're being told and shown is the Cobra symbol. So for the Walmart exclusive, it's going to be the normal Cobra symbol. That we all grown up in love. The Cobra Hiss tank, Dr Cobra Commander, is what they're calling the Mickey Mouse, which is basically the Cobra symbol on the bottom, but where the eyes are supposed to connect, there are two slits to make them look like the eyes are separate. I don't know why they did it, but that's what to expect from the differences between the his tank cobra commander and the walmart exclusive uh that's it for me guys thanks for watching hope you enjoyed the video uh mr nate gomez another 808 collector thank you for my mind bender he is pretty awesome For me, the one thing that I love about Hawaii, or the Hawaii community as far as collectors go, is that the collectors here, we try and help each other. Now that does not include the guys buying and reselling. I'm talking about the real collectors. And I've never seen that in the States before. So, you know, for all the Hawaii collectors, I have to thank you guys. You know, we, we have a page on Facebook, 808 Collectors. Uh, like I said, in Hawaii, there is the crop end of the shipment, the last... We get whatever's left over. So for us, helping each other find what we want is definitely helpful and special. That's what Hawaii brings to collectors. That's why I'm doing a lot of these videos is to show you guys what the difference is with collecting here in Hawaii. Finding stuff, mailing in stuff, what we have to ship and bring over, and just the community itself. So, you know, special thanks to every single one of you guys in our community. Keep up the good work. Be on the lookout. Thank you again to Nate. Otherwise, it would be a while since I got a mind member. And again, in a next week, December 4th, is supposed to be the release date here in the US for Dusty, Zorana, and the Crimson Guard. 
So be on the lookout for them. Thanks again. Thanks for watching, everybody. Take care. Hope everybody had a great Thanksgiving. I I would say I had a pretty good Thanksgiving. Because that is what I got. Finally found one. Uh, no games yet, so I'm, it's kind of hooked up, but not playing. See you guys later.